I think the clearest um, feeling you can get uh, on this as well as other issues is go back to the original diaries. Early Mormons who were faithful had no problem with being both Masons and Mormons. They, they were, could be faithful to their uh, agreements they made, their promises they made in the lodges as well as to the temple. And they didn't have any problem with, with where things come from. In fact, most of them tended to say, this is something more than I've experienced in Masonry. Why? For two reasons. One, there was a power there. There was a connection. This is a saving ritual. It's not just beautiful philosophical truths, as wonderfully as they're presented in Masonry, but it's something that connects me with God. As one scholar, uh, Kathleen Flake, used to say, Joseph Smith, instead of just giving them the, the truth of philosophy, was able to give them the reality of experience. And that's what they were seeking in the temple ritual.